actually work there, they could have just grabbed the van. But you are trained on, I'm assuming, any job, you are trained on certain ways that you do things. You got the world watching, you're gonna wanna stay by the book. So for example, leaving branches in the street, well, that was blocking traffic. You wouldn't do that if it was real. But they're just, you know, it's all fake anyway. They're not even, they're working like they don't need the money, is what this looks like to me. But that's exactly what it is. They don't need the money. They might not even fucking work there, like the athletic department. They might work there, I don't know. They might not. You know, they have a van, but... Now, here's another thing. This, this other guy drives his own car, but they have a van. Now, you know, I don't know how insurance works on, on state, you know, this and that employee, but if he's driving his car and he gets in a car accident, who's in trouble? I mean, this is a liability issue for the state now, right? So, wouldn't you then, they're going to make the argument, well, well, we have stuff in the back of the van. Well, your van is full of crap, but it's not actually useful crap. I mean, stuff on the dashboard, that's not professional either. If you can't fit this guy, it's not like you have so many tools or trash bags, for example, that you're not even bringing enough tools, right? You're not bringing the required stuff. So, <laughs> if you don't even have room for all your employees, aren't you going to, what is it, clean out the van? But they're not doing that. Why? Because this isn't real. If this was your job seven days a week, you'd be damn sure to go over all the liability, professionalism, have enough tools, and not have over too many people, too many cooks in the kitchen. You're hiring a three-person job to what? Stand around? And they're going to do a half-ass job at the end of the day. Watch, they won't pick up any of these. Uh, this is about cleaning up this area. No, it's not. Again, it's just about making a better view. She did fuck all. For day two. You really think the state's going to keep this person employed? <laughs> what is what? They're prolonging the process of this de-weeding project. And with just absolutely no professionalism. They even broke a pipe. And didn't fix it, by the way. I mean, it, this is like Jokers, man. This is total Jokers. Just pointing it out to you. Things you should see. Just I like to see her state paperwork, see if she's actually in play. I hate highlights like that. Like, why do people not know how to blend? If you're gonna go for a goddamn, if you're gonna go for a storage contrast, at least do it like Milani does it. Like she's doing it, you know, in the front, but it looks good because it's still, even though it's a storage contrast, it's blended. I hate when people do that shit. It's Halloween. I'm like, why are you wearing Halloween on your head? That's all it looks like to me. Okay, so we'll just take a look, see at my stuff again. If they have some sort of testimony. Oh wait, that's all. And, um, you know, we'll see if they leave. I'll film it till they leave. Oh, and they're just going to throw that out. That's totally professional. Right? So, you didn't see them picking up garbage, or they're leaving, look, little Missy with her little picking up one branch and pretending. Look at all the shit they left. Does that make any goddamn sense to you? No, because it's fake work. Okay? Now... That does, that does make things more complicated for my view, but nothing I can't get around. Why? Because luckily, this bush stays and I sleep behind that. It's actually not going to, like Richard, I know you're paying a lot, but it's not actually going to affect anything for me. So, I mean. Now, look at their van. This is again, another, this guy's car. That's a liability issue. I'm not running the state department, but it just seems like it makes logic. And actually, I mean, is there really stuff in that van? You don't, you guys, you don't do it that way. You're not like, hey, buddy, come on down to the... No, everyone meets at the office and you all get in the same car. That's, that's how companies are run. Especially with state stuff. No one wants their ass getting sued. I know it's in America, but it's still a possibility. Look at all the shit they left. Look at all the weeds they left. You guys. This is, um, look, didn't pick up one thing of garbage. Not one thing of garbage. 
But it won't, they're still not going to run the vantage point, so it doesn't, it's like a lot of fake work for nothing. And that's it. They came in to do 40 minutes of non-fake work, three people for a one-person job, talked most of the time, took a break even, that's included in the 40 minutes, and that's the whole thing. <laughs> you know. I'm just not letting him have the Eureka moment because that's some horse shit. But oh, that's good. Have a cigarette because he worked so hard. Actually, he's the only one that did work. Now, realistically, they all would have worked like him had it been real. And even he's taking it. I would, if I were an employer, I would still say he's taking it a little bit easy with all the little breaks and stuff. But for them, I'd be like, you're fired. Oh, look, they got backup. That's good. Now it's a four-person job. <laughs> right. Let's keep going. Oh, five, six-person job, seven-person job. This is now a seven-person job. They can't use that machine if that's what they're thinking because there's pipes everywhere. You have to rip up all the pipes. Okay, it's a six-person job. <laughs> oh, is that Adidas? Oh my god, are you serious? Wow, I'm so surprised. <laughs> they can't use that machine here, you guys. It, I mean, there's rocks, there's pipes, they're all staring. Look, they're all staring. Do you know why? Because they are. Because they know what this is really about. So, I mean... There'd be no reason, you guys, to look up and get weird if there's no reason to look up and get weird. But there is, so. It's pretty funny, actually. <laughs> I like it. Look at all this. Little, little me. Little me, and look what I cause. Right. Three cars, six people. Hella standing around. No, your state's watching. I'm gonna get to work. They got time. So, it's pretty funny. She's a bitch, man. I don't like her. Can you see it? Yeah. I'm, I'm like, Ooh. I'm sure you've had a lot of catty moments in your life. So anyway, this is uh, this is the joke work. Good thing there's six people. That's good. The world is watching, and this is how you want to represent the state's money. No, they're working like they don't need to work. <sighs> they're running out the clock. Ay, 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 ay. Right, you guys? First time in five years. So, let me, well, here's another point. I'm, I'm just talking to you because they're still here. No. If this was deemed just like, oh, shit, that doesn't look good, and we want to represent Gandhi while well, I'm just bringing attention to this one point, and that's going to be your excuse as to why then you're going to represent Gandhi a well. If you're going to take it that seriously, you're going to do an efficient job, you're going to do a good job, you're going to send competent workers, you're going to do a thorough job, and um, and this is not going to be the reality. But it's not actually about making the parts look good.
Right? What a coincidence. First time in five years. That's about the estimate. You see how tall those little things were yesterday? Yeah. She really didn't want me filming. Oh, honey, I wouldn't either. No one likes losing hella money and Fools, you don't understand. You're so fucking cocky. I'm like, no, I will press charges. Do you get that? It's not just you're sued and you look bad. You can go to jail for what you're doing and you don't seem to get it. I really wouldn't fuck with Trump. I really fucking wouldn't. Terrorism shit? Ooh, I mean, you're making America look bad, Spain. I would get a grip on your people. I really fucking would. Like Europe, I really would because... When you lie, you're making America look incompetent. Do you want that? I wouldn't want to do that. Not with a president that's very down to go to war. I'm not saying he would war Europe. I'm just saying I wouldn't fucking piss him off. Ain't Obama, you know what I mean? So, anyway, they'll probably be standing there wasting time for a while. Go check, see if they're starting anything. They won't be. Why? Because it's like... Oh, sitting around shooting the shit. Cool. But I'll come back to it if they come up. I'll wait. <laughs>